Ref for cheat. Little did Rovers striker Paul Randall know what was in store for him in Saturday's vital top of the table clash. The cloud's anger started when Paul Randall was signalled offside when many thought he'd been played onside and an early goal was denied to Bristol Rovers. Certainly it was a late flag and subsequent decisions were to enrage the crowd even more. Rovers' goal came from deep in their own half when Parkin brought the ball out and passed to David Williams. He saw former QPR man Mark O'Connor free on the wing and O'Connor showed some first division footwork to beat Hull's defence and float a perfect cross to the waiting Archie Stevens. It was a great goal and one which should have ensured victory for Bristol Rovers. But Rovers' attack was constantly thwarted by a series of offside decisions, 11 in all, including that one which is clearly not. Randall had become so frustrated by then, he allegedly showed dissent by clapping to the crowd. Linesman Keith Tilly was not amused, and referee Butler booked Randall, his name joining Brian Williams for a similar offence. Well, Hull's reply to that loss of concentration was emphatic. While McCaffrey tried to haul Whitehurst down, he still managed to get in a shot which had Cashley well beaten. So the game ended one apiece and Rovers are now without a win in four outings, but still in second place. Well, the fans had the final say, shouting the word cheat as the players and officials left the field.